And good evening, everyone. Just eight days after the Supreme Court blocked one New York State gun law, the state has enacted a new one. This law, passed tonight, imposes new restrictions on concealed weapons. The state Senate passed the bill by a two-to-one margin. The Assembly passed it tonight, and shortly before 9 p.m., Governor Kathy Hochul signed it. The package strengthens licensing agreements that New Yorkers need to obtain a firearms license. It also allows private property owners to opt in if they want to allow weapons on their property. The new law increases the age limit when guns must be locked in a household from 16 to 18 years old. One Democrat in the Assembly explained why he believes this fixes issues with the law overturned by the U.S. Supreme Court. Now, a wider pool of individuals now have the opportunity to apply for that permit. And our goal was to create a statewide system that was consistent. Um, yes, it does have some restrictions on where people can uh, carry their conceal and carry uh, guns, but at the same token, you know, it's important to understand that we have a process in place that actually provides for a proper screening of individuals. This new law takes effect in two months on September 1st. And the new law passed tonight also addresses an issue some lawmakers had with a gun reform bill the governor signed just last month. The new law contains a body armor amendment. Governor Hoko says the new law prohibits sales of hard body armor to most people. Police and prosecutors say the gunman in the top's mass shooting was wearing a steel-plated vest. Uh, the chairman of the New York State Republican Party wasted no time blasting the gun bill that passed earlier tonight. This bill they just passed is a gross infringement on New Yorkers' rights and makes us all less safe. Only under the insanity of New York Democrats can criminals illegally possessing firearms be let out of jail free. But law-abiding citizens exercising their Second Amendment rights, they're under assault by their own government. I'm sick and Nick Langworthy, who's also running for the Republican line in the 23rd Congressional District, said he will sue the state to stop this new gun law. 